I think it's a good way of saying it is it's Alaska and then everywhere else. First of all, you're flying around in a helicopter in like these crazy peaks and it's just, everywhere you look is the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. You go out there in these areas and you don't see anybody else. There's no other groups out there. The line choice is yours to make. I mean, it's just the experience, not only of making the turns, but getting dropped off in the heli. It's an ultimate feeling of freedom for me. Triple Point Expeditions is an Alaska-based heli ski operation. We're built around providing our guests with the best possible experience we can every single day. Every run was the best run of my life, I would say. You know, a first track 2,000 foot vertical, long S turns down a mountain, it's, it's, I don't think there's a better feeling in the world. The potential to score is just off the charts. We can optimize the ski run to every single guest. We've got anything that you want, any sort of ability level can come and ski with us. From the lodge, we can transport people into the mountains to go skiing in a matter of seconds. There's only eight people skiing, two groups of four on a heli, which is more than you can, you can ski. You can't out-ski the helicopter. They have access to so many different mountain ranges, and if the weather's not good at one, they're able to pivot quickly and take you to the other mountain range. It's really like teleporting you into a world that you otherwise couldn't get into. I can't access this train on my own. A triple point expedition safety is the first and foremost of every single day and every single trip. In order for us to do what we do, we take our jobs really seriously, we take safety really seriously, and we do a ton of due diligence to mitigate the risks that we face. The reason that we can do what we do is because of the amount of time and experience that we have doing this. Every day we're watching the weather, we're looking at the avalanche forecasts, creating our own avalanche forecasts, working on fuel logistics, working on food logistics, working on helicopter logistics, and dialing it in. We want the guests to go and focus on skiing and having a good time and know that the back end and every little detail has been meticulously planned and everything's taken care of. The minute you get to this lodge to the minute you leave is just this full immersion in the most epic vacation for snowboarding. The accommodations here are just amazing. It doesn't feel like you're in like a hotel or an experience like that. It feels like you're more in like a home. We strive to be inviting. I want people to feel welcome. I want people to come and be part of the crew and be part of the team. I really want to provide an experience where people get to know us on a personal level and get to know the other guests on a personal level. And here it's like, you're leaving with everybody's cell phone numbers. That's here. The food has been exceptional. It's insane, the food's insane. I don't even know where to begin on the food experience. Hands down, the best culinary experience over a seven day period we've ever experienced. I mean, it's, it's that good. The food is basically on par with the riding. They're both like totally world-class and insane. You can tell Tucker's put a lot of thought into adding different elements to this, uh, to give it a resort-like feel, like the sauna, hot tub. There's always something to do. Literally every day is an experience, and it's an expedition. And literally every day is gonna be something I go home and talk about. For me, it feels at home. Like, I feel like I'm like meant to be here or something, like in like a really kind of spiritual sense in the mountains. It's hard to explain the scale, but it makes you feel human. You're gonna test yourself. You're gonna test your limits. You're gonna be uncomfortable in a good way. The best part of my day is when everyone comes back and is high-fiving at the lodge and stoked to ski the best runs that they've ever skied.